Hi, this video covers how to install WaveMaker as an app on your desktop. It will also install onto a mobile device or a tablet quite easily. It'll give you a little alert when you visit wavemaker.cards, which is the URL for this, this app, this app uh, which will then create a copy on your device that you can use offline. Now, you will need Google Chrome for this, and it will run on Windows and Linux. It will also run on a Mac, but you do need to change a setting on the current version of Chrome for Mac, although that's likely to change in the very near future. So have a visit first, see if you get this alert at the top of the screen that says install this as an offline app. It may also work in the future on Firefox and Safari and uh, Internet Explorer because all of those browsers are leaning towards supporting this anyway. So it's a technology that's coming in. So it, at the moment, Chrome is the only one that does it seamlessly. So what you do is when you get here, you have the option to install as an off offline app appearing as a button. If that doesn't appear, you can always check by clicking on the three dot menu in the top right hand corner. And in the menu, sh you should find install WaveMaker appearing. So simply click on the button. It'll give you an option to install, install it. And mine's pretty fast because it's already downloaded all the files, but it might take a couple of seconds for you. It basically creates a version of the, of the web browser window and downloads all the files to it. So you've got a working offline version of this, the app. Uh, this can be used exactly like the web version. Uh, it stores stuff locally the same way, and you can upload stuff to Google Drive as well. Uh, to uninstall, quite straightforward. Three dot menu again, uninstall WaveMaker. It'll ask you if you want to remove it, you leave. And that's it removed. Now, I hope you enjoy using WaveMaker. It's free software. However, if you do want support us, please consider becoming a patron. There are links in the video comments below.